hammering a little bit, but um, I had a little time today to broadcast. So I'm going to start doing this more often. The more games I come out, I'm going to start going from putting in for like an hour, two hours a day, man, because I'm trying to do my thing and become a professional gamer because I love doing this. I've been playing games since I was a kid. Video games are, are the truth, and they've got better over the years with the graphics, and this game's amazing, so... I'm going to add my camera in a little bit so you can get a face to the, to the voice. Yeah, you know I'm saying? But um, enjoy, though. <laughs> Sebastian, where are you? Is that what I think it is? We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel figs cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure! When will you accept that? Never. I can never accept it. <laughs> Tell them what you've done. I'm sorry. Hogwarts, baby, let's go. <laughs> This game is the truth. I'm sorry you had to see that. If you don't mind, I just need a moment alone. Poor Sebastian. Not the visit he'd hoped for. I'm sorry about earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. Are you all right, Anna? I didn't mean to intrude. I like the special you Hogwarts didn't. jacket I got Truly. on. Represent your class. And I'm all right. You only unlock this, this comes in by bounds. unlocking this chest in your it's not uh, anyone's your home fault. room. It's you nice know what I mean? And you, you get this dope-ass jacket, man. You must be man. the new really fifth year cool. Sebastian told me about. I am. <coughs> Sebastian and I met during a rather lively duel in defense against the dark arts. Oh, dear Professor Hecate. She's a powerful back and witch. Forth between the robe and, the jacket, and she knows how to keep students really dope, like though. my brother and me in line. <sighs> I do miss Hogwarts, but I wouldn't mind being in Feldcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cozy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-Aura, but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. I'll do my best. I can promise to speak with him about it. Thank you. His search for a cure was <coughs> not time, I'm afraid. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. I wish you well. Revelio. Revelio. Mm. Here. That intruder. Hey man, I'm coming no shit, man. What's going on, pal?
<laughs> uh, shit, just uh, broadcasting online, man, playing this Hogwarts. Uh, YouTube. I got actually uh, set up my Twitch account, man. This game is wild, fam. Mm hmm. You would. Rebellion. That shit's wet, fam. That shit's hella wet. Alohomora. Revelio. I just do that? I did. Rebellion. Thank you. Uh, it's supposed to be like a DLC or whatnot, fam. To this. It's on some, um, what I've heard, on some multiplayer ish, you know what I mean? Yeah, that'd be right way, you know what I'm saying? That boy will fray my last nerve. Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. Oh, yes, Sebastian's friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. I was about to check on Anne. Did I see you come from the house? How is she? She's all right. She said she was going to rest. Nothing can be done for her. It could be that you've not yet discovered the cure. Ah, you sound like Sebastian, thinking you know better than the healers at St. Mungo's. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. Some sort of dark magic cursed Anne, and the goblins aren't likely to explain themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne Damn, comfortable. Damn, giving her hope is cool. That's stay out of the loyalist's way. With all due respect, sir, hope could keep Anne's spirits up. You may mean well, but I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. I hope you'll remember what I've said. Good day. I ought to see how Sebastian's faring. Mm, it's gonna be a little rough, man. But, uh... Why will he not listen to me? She's my sister. Hold on, man. Let me change my clothes. Good one. 
gold trim, baby. That gold trim, I guess it just does it for me. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first-hand glance at what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. I'll admit, I wasn't expecting him to be so angry. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow, always calling me my father's son. As if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be underestimated. All the debris you'll see is from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. They've been digging for something. Up there, on that plateau, is where they cursed Anne. This way. How much longer are we expected to dig through this rubble? Man, rock, man, boy. It's an honor to be a part of this. <laughs> Nothing, yo. Let's handle these things going on around Shio. I'm gonna hit you with this one. I I Oh, this is good. I won't 
Or your body, yeah. I confess, that was a oh. bit more than I bargained for. I tried to warn you. Uh, Revelio. Yes, yes. I broke somebody's what? Well, nah. Uh, Repel. Oh, wait a minute. Excuse me, sorry about Repel. that. There it is, baby. Revelio. What you looking at, man? Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. This is where it happened. We smelled smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before my uncle and I could stop her, and rushed out, racing towards the fire, worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. It seems an awfully violent response to a child wandering by. What were they trying to hide? My thoughts exactly. Right. It may be Ooh. grasping at Billywigs, but I keep thinking that there might be something here that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her, which could help me find a cure. Perhaps you're right. The loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here, and it's likely they're hiding something. And at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? They seem Rebellion. to have set up camp here for a specific reason. They have stations for everything. I've heard that goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the Ministry isn't doing more. Always armed and ready for a fight, Ranrock's loyalists. one a dollar, what? Revelio. Whose home was this? A bit abandoned long since I've lived here. Rumor was a Hogwarts professor lived here once, centuries ago. But that's all I ever heard. It might be worth coming to look at the house itself. Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. 
Revelio. Sebastian, I've seen this before. This house, the well, the view. What do you mean? When? Give me a moment. I'll explain in a second. This well looks familiar. Yeah. Get that dollar for Sebastian, over here. Do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Could be. But it looks to me as though this was intentional. Sebastian, this house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? What you playing over there, Pensive That day in the restricted section, with a memory that showed this house. There was a little girl and a drought. The keepers have shown me other memories as well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganark. Are you playing some Call of Duty? You on me, she man. was one of the keepers. The keepers? Like <coughs> And you found a pensive in the library. I'm not following you. I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand. <laughs> Basically, like he was on this shit. He's a, I'm no, not following you. Not like Quidditch. They call themselves keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It has to do with the vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. You can see traces of an ancient magic that you think Ranrock is trying to harness. And now you've been witnessing memories left by keepers. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch keepers hundreds of years ago. If I didn't know you, I'd think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it, when you put it like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the keepers. Look at this. Someone piled this here for a reason. Is it blocking something? Only one way to find out. Confringo! Huh, a stairwell. Lumos. Why bother blocking a stairwell? There might be something here worth a closer look. Lumos. They've left all of this simply strewn about. Tells me they're after something bigger. Hmm. Seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. Lumos. Confringo. Lumos. You're not going to believe this. I can see the Undercroft. What? A daydream? Because that happens to me too. No, I'm just no daydream, dude. Like, we can see some shit over there. I know it sounds strange, but honestly, <coughs> nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. Fair enough. I can see the Undercroft through this stone wall as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I think it's to do with my ability to see traces of ancient magic. But you said you didn't really understand it and that you couldn't wield it. That's true. And I'm still not sure what it all means. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. <laughs> Ominous will be flawed. We can. 
but perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now. Even ominous. Understood. Well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway? Here we come. I'm tempted to Lumos. hold my breath. A journal entry of Isadora's. I should hold on to this. Why would the door lead us here? Sebastian, look. Why hide a triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. A note. Let's have a look. Hmm. Anything helpful in the note? A rune symbol. I've seen similar symbols used by the keepers. I've been thinking. A keeper lived in that house centuries ago, and Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Hmm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. Then we'll have to unravel what this all means. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry, I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You did not. Sounds worth looking into. Any idea where in the castle? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. I had no idea our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. But I'm glad you told me everything you did. I'll be in touch. Till then. Rebellion. Meet me near the ruins of Falbarton Castle. After dark, do not tell anyone. I like this jacket. I can't, I can't do it with it. That jacket's dope.
can. I'm just going to This game is dope. Oh. That's somebody else. Yeah, that's what I'm going. Meet, here I come. Revelio. Over here, quietly. Over here, over I'm here. glad that you received my owl. We need to stay low and remain quiet. Lassie, what's going on? Why are we all the way out here? As promised, I did some investigating to find out what Harlow is up to. I followed him to the Hulk's head. I noticed him reading a letter. All I could see was that it was signed by and bore the seal of Victor Rookwood. And after you told me that Rookwood and Harlow were after you, I decided that you were the perfect person to join me in taking them down, for good. That letter is the tangible proof that Officer Singer needs. It is why I followed Harlow here, and why I wrote to you. I need your help to retrieve it. Can't we just bypass Officer Singer and go directly to the Ministry? Do you think they will listen to a student? Only Officer Singer can start an investigation. The Ministry will come in later. You seem to be very determined in stopping Rookwood and Harlow. Why? I knew men like him in Uganda. I know how bad things can get if they are not stopped. It's their long story, when I promise to share when we have more time. For now, let's do what we came to do. I'll help you find the letter, Natty. I'm glad to hear it. First, we must access the castle keep. I'll check the main gate, see if you can find another way in. I do not see any guards, but we should still try to be as quiet as possible. Hollow is here after all. Let's do it. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Revelio. Does he all shut the hell up? You all loud?
Oh, I'm good. Let's continue on here. Cool. Revelio. Hmm. I wonder what that does. Oh no, 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 I'm fucking, I'm tripping, I'm tripping. Where is that shit? What was I using? Okay, let's, uh... I think so. That sounds... Not enough. Akio, Indonia Leviosa. Okay. Where's the. Uh... I'm missing something. I'm missing something. Revelio. I'm missing some of this shit. That's what's fucking with my nerves. That's goddammit. Wingardium Leviosa. Arrest on the Where fucking go? Rebellion. Yeah. I need to find a way into the gatehouse to open the gate for Natty. Oh, we're going to get in here, buddy. Can you bring us? That's a game. Hold on, bro. 
dead end. Must be another way in. Why I couldn't jump fucking? You can jump through there. Don't cut it out, yo. That looks as if it might raise the gate. main keep. My guess is that we'll find Hollow and the letter inside. We'll need to be careful once we get... I hear them. Get the evidence and you free that hippogriff. Agreed? This is our chance. Go! Ugh. Blasted! There's gotta be another way to get up to the roof. Of course, Somewhere. we would have to go in another way. I hope Natty stays out of trouble. Oh my god. Not the safest place to sneak into. Quick. 
that thing is down there. Oh, I want to do that so bad. I hope Natty's having an easier time of it. Aloha, Mora. Hmm, I got lucky on that one. I'll just start off the green automatically. I look everywhere, excuse me. Oh, you want to you're yeah. going home in a wooden box! You know where you're going? Off the Arrest the momentum. I understand. So I asked up out of here. Doing shenanigans. That was a long fall. Hello, Hamora. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, oh God. Oh God. You come here, little fella. Wrapped around here. Well, love to take.
don't need them on my own, man. Revenue. Wing. It's all right. There mm. we go. She's like, you see this shit, man? I mean, these motherfuckers are all. There you are. Come on. Hello, Omar. the Hogwarts Express must be returning from an unscheduled run. This game is so dope, yo. They did a phenomenal job. Hands down, like this 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 shit is amazing. isn't it? Exciting. <laughs> it was exhilarating, wasn't it? I wasn't sure we were going to make it out alive. <laughs> there was no need to worry. I had it all under control. Were you able to find the letter? Summoned it straight out of Harlow's hands. <laughs> I will say, I did not expect to see him cast the killing curse at us. He won't forget this. Be on your guard. Of course. What did the letter say? That Rookwood's looking for a phoenix. <laughs> Not sure where he will find one. But it also included Harlow's orders to inspect that castle for the poachers. Enough to connect Harlow to the crimes. I shall deliver the letter to Officer Singer. She'll have to do something when she sees it. Now, 
Tell me, where did you meet these hippogriffs? I've only met Hyrum before. Poppy introduced us. Poppy Sweeting knows a hippogriff. <laughs> of course she does. Poppy will be relieved to know that Highwing's safe. I came to the right person for help. My mother will be worried. I must go. Seek me out soon. I shall have much to tell you. Snuckers. Back off after. Shindig. can't imagine how stopped by the rule of requirement. Deke tells me he has something to share with you. Right on. First of all, I need this. So that should be uh Revelio. Come here, buddy. Don't shoot me. Let me Yeah, come on over here, buddy. 
Nice to see you, my young friend. Mm -hmm. I feel like something was chasing me right just then. Revelio. Oh, I'm kicking some ass while I'm over here. I'm there, you little bastards. Professor Howard will have you believe this. I should investigate.
Trying to capture birds and shit. You interrupting that shit. Let me go. Near I find you. Let me outside. On the car. See, but look, you see. Oh my goodness. Revelio. You know. Okay. Although we're kind of animal. Alright, uh, I'm capturing animals right now, folks. This place is seen better. It looks a little dark on up in here. Oh. Yeah. Why oh, sound like the trees is growling? Revelio. Uh, fuck them spiders. Spider me. I'm down, baby. Oh, y'all back here fighting now, right? I knew y'all had. Nope. Y'all go ahead and do what you got to do. <sighs> no one to share in my victory. Pretty sure. Okay, listen. Wait a minute. What the hell was that? I'm over here looking for some animals, man. Revelio. Snipple Griffin and sell. Now, I need to differentiate which one is which because I know some of these bad boys be having 
stars next to him, and I know those stars like when you breed them, you'll have some little different kids, like you know, special shit. Oh no, shit. I didn't even have a rifle. Revelio. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. Levio. <laughs> Rebellion. Revelio. I don't want to work with goblins. Not, not ever. Work with gunmen. Hmm.
fast traveling right now just to catch all these animals and then field guide I'm most pleased to be included This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Revelio. Let me say. These rocks have seen better days. Too soon. Ugh. Revelio. Confringo. Found himself 
would be proud. Revelio. Revelio. Confringo. That solves that. Who says I'm coming in? I'll be back. 